More often than not, I prefer a long style like this braided waterfall by Paula Young. But if you're looking for a shorter style, especially one with a little bit of sass, I think I have the perfect style for you. Let's go ahead and check out Trend by Tressa Lore. She is just a cute, curly, wavy, funky little style, and I'm gonna show her to you in three colors. So let's get to it. <music> Okay, so the first color that we're going to look at is 33 130 R4. Okay, and let's open her up. Ooh. I've done 3231, but I've not done this one. So this one is um, a similar color, but it does definitely look like it's a very rooted style. The 3231 looks a little bit more like it's highlighted throughout. It's really, really pretty. It says that she's short textured layers, beachy waves. You can see that. Really textured, beachy waves. She has feathered bangs. She is a monofilament comfort monotop. Lace front, she is double hand knotted. Let's look at her cap construction. So, I mean, this is a gorgeous cap construction. She does have the ear-to-ear -ear feathered bangs so that they can kind of go any direction that you want. Undetectable hairline, and she does have the mesh, not mesh, wefted cap. Uh, she does have Velcro straps. She does have the uh, extended nape, and she does have the bendable ear tabs. So she's got a beautiful, beautiful cap construction. She's uh, uh, pretty short. Someone had said that it reminded her of Flawless Waves. Flawless Waves is a full cap wig. I'm pretty sure. I can't remember if I did a review on Flawless Waves or not. I think I did. I'm not sure. She feels shorter than Flawless Waves and also Flawless Waves is not a monotop or a lace front. Let me look at her. So see, you can move these bangs all around. This is definitely, now this is a very, very cute wig, but I'm gonna tell you, this is one of those styles that you're gonna have to play with this to get this to be in the spot that you're going to feel comfortable. This is gonna be one that you're gonna love when you get it to the place that you want it, but it's not going to just like come out of the box looking perfect. When you have curlier wavy styles and bangs, it's like all of the things that are very preferential. So I just wanna caution you on that. Um, when you get this and you put this on your head, please don't think this is gonna be like a put it on and go and you're gonna feel cute immediately. Uh, this is has all the elements of very personalized preference, <laughs> okay? All right, I think she looks pretty cute right there. But yeah, just please keep that in mind. She's a really adorable style, but I can feel like someone will get her and be like, what is going on? Because depending on where the curls are laying, how long it's been in the box, all those things, how you like your bangs, how you don't like your bangs, you're really, you know, do you need to wake up the fibers? Do you not? Like, please keep that in mind. I might actually film a little short video on that so that uh, you remind yourself of that or I remind you of that. It's very, very comfortable. Definitely a, a average cap. I am 21 and a half circumference, which is petite average. She feels very comfortable on me. Uh, I really like this color. The rooting is really beautiful. You can see that mono right there. So yeah, so this is in the reddish color. Let's look at the other two colors. I'm really excited. I remember doing the unboxing on this and this was the one that I was least excited about, but I remember I have two different gray shades and I remember when I put the gray shades on, I was like really, really excited. So I wanna get to those ones before I really get to my thoughts, okay? Okay, so this color here is the 52-38-49-R8, which is also known as the three-tone gray with brown. It's one of my favorite Tressalore colors. You've seen me in it a few times, but I uh, reviewed uh, Picture Perfect in this shade, and I actually thought this one would be my favorite, and it is really cute. Let's check her out from the back in this particular shade. You can kind of see how in the different colors or just in general, when you have sort of that wavy type uh, style, depending on how it's packaged, like I said, how long it's been in, just, you know, it can come to you in different ways. This is straight out of the box.
This is so cute. I really love this since this has the darker color underneath it really accentuates this particular this particular style i do really like it in this color i have to say uh but i think the next one is my favorite i can't wait for you guys to tell me which is your favorite of the colors um and also down below, I want you to chime in and let me know if you see a difference between how they come out straight out of the box, especially when they are, um, you know, sort of curlier or wavy styles. Okay, so I really can't decide between the last color and this one. This one is the 5660R8. And uh, this one is stunning as well. I love my three-tone gray with brown, but this one is just giving me a little something. I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you think out of the three, like, which one is the best? And also out of this one and the uh, three-tone gray with brown, which one's the best? I can't decide. I also don't know how I feel about this style. There's part of me that absolutely loves it. There's part of me that likes it. There's part of me that really loves it. There's part of me that kind of likes it. I definitely think it is unique. I think it's cute. I think I love it. I think I love it. I, my face is saying I love it. I was actually just looking back at the photos and sometimes I just do that. I look back at the photos I take and I think I look so cute in it. So I really feel like the photos are not like lying. They're real cute. Okay. So I'm happy with how the photos look. So I'd have to say yeah in the photos i feel happy with how they look and i'm curious to see how this particular one looks in the photos because i like how the last one looks in the photos but when i'm looking in the monitor this one looks really cute um i just don't know which one's cuter i don't know oh my gosh i'm like totally totally dying i'm curious to see how you think and what your thoughts are okay so that is the trend which one do you like so if you've seen all the new styles sheer joy shay and trend which one is your favorite out of these ones that i just showed you which of the three colors is your favorite out of the two grays which is the favorite of those if you haven't subscribed please consider doing so i would love to have you and if you have subscribed thank you so much I will see you in my next video. Bye.